Don't mind me while I just run over here. Hey, Akari. Thunder Wave? Really? She's looking... She's got, like, angry eyes on me right now. Like, what? Actually? A request from Mai. It seems that the Galaxy team has gotten requests from Mai of the Diamond Clan. Go hear more about it and lend her your help as a member of the Survey Corps. Uh, meet Akari in the training grounds. Thanks for coming. I know you're busy. Listen, I have had an... <laughs> That's not something you go around chatting, but sure. I've had an epiphany. Is everything all right? <laughs> you see, I've got a partner of my own. We may not get along perfectly, but we've got to work together to help complete the Pokedex. So serious. You have a partner. Yes, here's my partner. P of course it's Pikachu. Okay, and I'm calling it right now. Pikachu's going to say, Pikachu! Instead of making like the... the like modem sounds that they usually make for their calls. <gasps> I'm so happy they didn't give Pikachu mascot power and it actually has a sound instead of the um Oh I'm s Nintendo, I'm so proud. I'm so proud of you for for this decision. I'm so proud. Pika when we were attacked by those shinks, I got too scared to think straight and I couldn't handle battling as a team. Ever since then, my partners refused to listen to anything I tell them. And if I'm being honest, I'm not even sure how to order him, how to guide him in battle. Pika! But when I saw how you and your Pokemon worked together, I realized that we needed to do more too. So please, have a battle with me. I want to learn how to fight effectively. All right, so here's the trainer battle. Okay, 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 okay. All right, ra oh, grass flying. All right, so thundershock. Oh, I no, you snot. Uh, all right, so first of all, we want to do not that. What's that do? Strong style, agile style. Let's do agile style. I don't know what that means, but we're gonna. Gosh darn it! Okay, yeah, we need to change Pokemon. Like, oh my word! No, 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 no. Uh, so X. Pokemon. Go. Quick attack. Ew. Oh my word! All of these Pokemon do not work. But, Jinx, you're going to be it. Intimidate? Nope. Quick attack. Yeah, whatever. Oh, my word. What do you mean you can't fight? Of course, Pikachu's faster. Or not. Alright. Oh, my word. Uh, so, we're going to switch out to... Bidoof. One of the many Badoof that I have. Thunder Shock. Alright, whatever. Let's roll out. Badoof, roll out. There we go. Alright, that's fine. Don't mind me while I just run over here. Hey, Akari. Thunder Wave? Really? She's. Looking, she's got like angry eyes on me right now. Like, what? Actually? Roll out. Why are you looking at me? Oh, nose. Oh, nose. All right, let's bring out another Bidoof. All right, Bidoof, you know what to do. Roll out. Battle, well, yeah, there's only one Pokemon. This is pretty normal. You and your Pokemon seem to be completely in step with one another. Right. Ooh, we got new moves. Okay, 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 okay. Phew, thank you for battling us. I could be wrong, but for a moment, I felt like Pikachu and I finally understood one another. 
let's keep working on it, okay, Pikachu? Pika! G guess I was wrong then. But I'll strive to work more as a team with my partner the way you do. Oh, don't be so sad. Assuming Pikachu and I can bridge some gaps. Oh, by the way, the professor said that Pokemon have things called types, which apparently make a big difference in how battles go. Pikachu seems to be an electric type, for example. <laughs> oh, look at that's that's the eye chart right there. Yeah, um, that's correct. Type matchups. Wait a minute, more type matchups. Yeah, whatever. It's fine. I blah 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 blah. So you're the one, the new recruit everyone's talking about. Name Zisu, captain of the security corps. Corps? <laughs> corps. Uh, I see you've got some fight in you. I figured I'd stop by and give out advice I could. Captain Zisu is a master of ancient martial art. One that specializes in Pokemon battles. So this is like the style thing I bet, right? Now listen, if your Pokemon's truly mastered its moves, it can use them in different styles. On one hand, you can choose to deliver a move in the strong style. This move will deal more damage, but afterwards it will take longer for your Pokemon to act. On the other hand, you can choose to unleash a move in agile style. Such a move will have less power behind it, but your Pokemon can act more quickly afterward. In truly favorable conditions, it might even get out two moves before the opponent can act. Strong style moves, agile style moves, and of course regular moves. Choose which is right for you in a given situation and direct your Pokemon with a little nudge. Nudge, nudge. Once your Pokemon has mastered a move, it can ha you can have it use the move in either agile style or strong style by pressing the L or R button or the left or right button when selecting a move in battle. Sometimes your Pokemon will naturally master a move and unlock these extra styles but simply by leveling up. Agile Styles reduces the power, raises the speed, uses more PP. Strong Style boosts the power, lowers the speed, and uses more PP. Oh, one more thing. If you want to teach your Pokemon some powerful moves, just let me know. Alright, so you're also one of the move tutors. Okay. Okay, okay. Zisu's teachings should serve you well when you're up against tough Pokemon. Now I suppose it's time to meet Mei. You remember, I mentioned the wallflower. I mentioned at the wallflower <laughs> that I could use your help with my request. I actually, now I do remember. Thank you very much. I am to meet her down past the foot of Aspiration Hill. You should come as well once you've readied your Pokemon team and perhaps had them learn some new moves from Zisu if you'd like. Guiding now active. A request from my... All right, Obsidian Feelands, my from the Diamond Clan. Um, how? Okay, so everyone's rehealed. All right. Here at the training grounds, your Pokemon can master their moves or learn new moves. Um. Hello there, Survey Corps recruit. Did you need something from me? Um, what does exchange items do? I'll pass on that. Master moves. I don't have to see the mastery. All right. New moves. So I kind of want to know if abilities are a thing. Ooh, okay, so natures are a thing. Alright. Gives you lots of good, like, EV training stuff, too, it looks like. I like that. Alright. I don't see ability in here, though. Hmm. I'll have to look that up. So Shinx is traditionally a physical attacker, so I kind of want to find a Shinx that has plus attack, at least. 
or plus speed. That's all right. Let's use the Shinx. Oh, cool. And it's just money. All right. Lovely. Um, okay. Okay. Honestly, let's do Thunderfang and Ice Fang and Fire Fang. Yeah, I got the money. Nice. All right, so now I want to actually go grab the Shinx and swap him out. I also want to put Wormple in my party too. Can we teach Wormple any moves? Nope. What about Rowlet? False Swipe, that's going to be good for catching Pokemon. Aerial Ace, yeah, sure. Magical Leaf. It's a never miss. Rest is a uh, sleep, sleep heal. Let's do that. Yeah. All right. Okay, so I think that's good. Now I want to go find the pastures next. We're not ready yet for this nonsense. Uh. Where are the pastures? Practice field, near quest, farm, farm, train grass, green front gate, pastures. There we go. So that's going to be through the end of the town and then across the bridge. All right, got it. So this is basically like the Pokemon boxes of the other games. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh look, they're all in there. Oh, that's so lovely. All right. That's adorable. Uh, the pastures house the mini Pokemon you catch. Collect them from here to change up your party. Uh, yeah, I would like to change everything up. So this Shinx. It's gonna swap for my level four Shinx. I think it's maybe this level four sh check moves. All right, maybe it's this one then. I think I got the right one. Change moves. Yeah. Wait, can't I have... Oh, I see, okay. Perfect, there we go, we got it set. Yes, I am. I actually want to do the same thing with Starly, with the move tutor. tutor. So, but I'll figure that out in a minute. We don't need this Bidoof. We've got plenty of them. Can use a water type though. Let's move Buizel in here. And a bug type. Wurmple. Okay, cool. So let's move multi-select, select. Okay, perfect. All right, so. Okay. Can I name my poke? I really want to name my Pokemon. Change name. There we go. Mr. Owl, Maurice, Anut, Norbert, Wormy, Deggett. Alrighty, there we go. Now we have our now we have our team. All right. Ah. Uh, Yes, we are heading outside the village. Uh, we're going to the Obsidian Fieldlands.
Now, along the way here, I do actually want to continue working on the Pokedex, so I'm going to stop and catch things that meet that goal as well. Oh, I forgot what... Forgot this guy's voice. Um, did I surprise you? Bet I did. I was trying to, anyway. There's a secret technique to catching Pokemon, you see. We call it the secret back strike technique. Hitting a Pokemon's back with your Pokeball will surprise it, making it easier to catch or giving you an advantage once a battle starts. Uh, higher chance, successful catch, or gain an advantage in battle, back strike. If you're part of the Survey Corps now, working to create that Pokedex as they all are, you might end up meeting every last Pokemon out here in Hisui. You should know I'm already looking forward to the day you accomplish that. Right, what do you want with mushrooms? Oh, you're the boy that fell from the Survey Corps that fell from the sky, aren't you? Listen here a moment. I need to tell you about this great cake lure recipe I invented. I call it the mushroom cake. I poured 20 years of mushroom foraging know-how into coming up with the recipe, and I know it's a winner. Problem is, the folks around here just aren't catching on to my recipe's amazing But you're the talk of the village. If people see you making my mushroom cakes, famous as you are, I'm sure they'll want to give it a go too. I'll teach you the recipe. All you have to do in return is spread the good word by using it. Oh, and you'll need to get yourself the key ingredient for the recipe yourself. Scrounge not from the forages of thy fellows, as the old saying goes. One springy mushroom is all you need. I'll be waiting. Yay. Okay, cool. Alright, so... Let's look at this video here first and see. Uh, we need to catch more of them. We need to catch more heavy ones. We need to defeat more of them. Uh, and we need to get additional forms, I guess. But I don't know why that one's not copied off. Whatever. It's fine. Cool, got another one. Well then, that was not what I anticipated, but I'll take it anyway. Cool, I got another heavy one. I'll take it. All right. So I kind of want to try this bat catch thing on this one here. Was that the the shape? Was that the dad? Did, did I do? I didn't do it. Yeah, of course you see me. That's fine. Shanks totally doesn't see me. It's fine. That's the thing. There's the ticket right there. Alright, let's battle. Let's fight, fight, fight. Alright, fight. Leafage. Leafage. Go. Nice. Good job, Mr. Owl. All right. So mission starts here. There are many strong Pokemon that make their home on the other side of this bridge. I can't let you let you pass unless you're first. Oh, at your rank, you should be fine. Yeah, I got a star. I, I got a gold star. Don't let your guard down now. Retreat to safety if you find yourself in trouble. All right. Uh, 
Over here. I suppose this is a Diamond Clan member. My, this is Enigma. <clears throat> my, my, a new face in the village. Not that it matters to me if you're new. If you're here, I assume you're prepared to be of help. I'm one of the wardens of the Di Diamond Clan. You may call me Mai. I suppose you might not even know what a warden is, if you're near to Hisui. But, we, but such talk can wait. Right now, I'd rather we get straight to the point. I have a problem that I need help solving. So the important question is this. Do you feel confident that you can lead your Pokemon in battle? Yes. That is good to hear. The security core of yours certainly wasn't up to the task. This here is my partner, Munchlax. We are raised together like siblings. He battles at my side by choice without needing silly little balls like you use. Watch and learn. There he is. All right, Mr. Owl. All right, fight. Uh, leafage, go. All right, so that's a crit. Oh, nuts. Oh, nuts. Oh, nuts. Uh, let's switch to a different Pokemon because that rock type move is going to cause us some problem. Ah. Yes, Norbert. Even though you're level 4, let's see it. Come on, Norbert. I believe in you. Fight. Oh, you don't, you don't have any water type moves. Wow, okay. Well, whatever. All right. Uh, can Maurice tank one? Let's see, because it's going to be super effective, but it should be able to tank one at least. Fight! And, uh, Strong Style Gust, let's do it. Wow, that did nothing. F. Yeah, it's yes, fix fixations. Okay. All right. Well, a newt, the level four Shinx. Let's see if you can handle one of these. The Thunderfang. Oh, come on! All right, we got we got this. We 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 we've got this. We've we've got this. Mm. Munchlax is down. Battle decided. Ooh, level eight. I'll take that. Mon, you really aren't one of the usual galaxy buffoons. If you could defeat my partner, who we'll fought Munchlax? I'll take care of the Pokemon that battle for us. Do, 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 do. And I'll let you have these. Materials. Vivichooks. Also called Morning Dew Bud. It is used as a material for crafting items that can restore vitality to a Pokemon that has fainted. So it revives, basically. You and your Pokemon fought well together. You practically acted as one with them. Rather like the legendary hero of old, the one we tell stories of to our children. I think you're indeed the one for the job. You see, I need someone to deal with an alpha Pokemon that's causing trouble upon Deer Track Heights. It's a large, fearsome foe like any alpha. But you'll come, won't you, to Deer Track Heights? Sorry, my phone's ringing. That thing you have, it's showing you where you've got to go, isn't it? Yes, this is my phone that lets me talk to God. That's... I know it's weird, but I, I landed here and I found my phone and it was all spiky and white and weird. And now God keeps just calling me. 
and for the uninitiated, supposedly Arceus is the god Pokemon. Yeah, we're in a really special situation. Anyway, my my, that is some curious sort of map. Is that one of those Galaxy Team inventions I keep hearing about? No, I just told you, God gave me this phone. It certainly does seem to show the way to Deer Trek Heights up ahead of us. I'll leave this in your hands. You'll do great out there. I know it. Thanks. It seems you're quite the asset to the Survey Corps, new one. Though, before we continue, I must ask, do you already know about Almighty Sinnoh? Almighty what now? I suppose that's to be expected. Allow me to sketch out the basics. Almighty Sinnoh steers all time. Wait, you mean Arceus, right? It's said to have created the very universe using its power over time's flow and this land of Hisui was born in the process. We of the Diamond Clan are the descendants of a people who crossed the sea and settled here in the Hisui region to venerate Almighty Sinnoh. However, it stole away from the world long ago, hiding itself from our sight. Almighty Sinnoh has only rarely been seen by any human if the tales are to be trusted. But still, there are Pokemon here today in Hisui with a connection to Almighty Sinnoh. And it is the duty of wardens like myself to attend to their needs. The Pokemon that graces Deer Trek Heights is one of those honored few. It is directly descended from a Pokemon that was blessed with Almighty Sinnoh's protection. Follow me and you may understand. Thank you for watching and as always, take care.